and run, and Ryan McCone going way inside, way too inside, getting hung up on a bump. He gets back out, but it's going to be Caldwell to the top spot early. Lee Caldwell, Fong Lee, Jeb Smith, and Ryan McCone. We'll see if Ryan can come back from this one. Another rough bobble there for McCone. Going to leave him well back from Caldwell. Fong with a bobble. Going to lose the spot to Ryan. Ryan getting one spot back. Ryan up to the three. Ryan up to the two. Jeff Smith dropping down to the four. Jeff Smith doing donuts. Jeff Smith with reverse. Jeff Smith still doing donuts. Well, went straight that time. So that's good. Race number three on the track. Race number four, you are up next. Sportsman 8 scale. Sportsman 8 scale. Have those vehicles ready. You guys will be up. Still Lee Caldwell out front. Ryan McCone is caught up. But Ryan still has to get around him. Caldwell running the old low C car. Oh, going way wide. That's the problem that car had. Going a little wide in the corners. New, new car fixed all that. Lee going outside, inside through the option line. Taking the fast guy line. And actually putting a little bit of daylight between himself and McCone with that maneuver there. McCone having to get on the binders to avoid blasting into him. It looks like it worked out for Caldwell. Caldwell double-double followed by McCone. They double over the small double in the center of the track. Back into the back section through the option. Both of them taking the inside option. It is much faster if you can pull it off. Two minutes down, three to go. Still Caldwell. Caldwell crossing the stripe. Your race leader, 23-6 to a 23-5. Ryan the fastest with 23-1. Mistake coming for Caldwell, though. Ryan going to make it by. Caldwell trying to look to the inside there. Couldn't find it. Both of them continuing to take the inside through the inside berm there. Through the short shoots, through that switchback section. Coming onto the straightaway. It is now McCone out front with the fastest lap of the night in stock. A 22-7. And Caldwell rolling it over. Getting smashed on by Jeff Smith. And Smith actually rolling him back over. That's right. So it is McCone, Caldwell, Fong Lee, Jeff Smith. Denny O no start. Matthew Lee broke his car in the beginner race, so wasn't able to get the car back out there here for stock buggy. Ryan McCone now with a good lead, stretching it out. 22-9 for McCone, 29-7 for Caldwell. Not good, Lee. McCone, though, throwing his lead away. Caldwell within a corner of him now, and McCone breaking the car. McCone driving it backwards on the straightaway, seeing if he could take anyone else with him, but it's going to be Lee Caldwell now in the top spot. It looks like the old car strikes again. The Olosi Triple X CR buggy, your race leader. Race leader in the CR, two spot. Going to be Fong now in the Associated. Jeff in the Associated. Jeff running that all black Associated B4 with the uh, J Concepts Punisher body on there and the dyed red J Concepts wheels. Your leader in the pink, black, and yellow running out front. Losi, Triple X CR buggy. The now discontinued platform from Losi. Fong moving up two, Smith moving up three. 30 seconds left to go. We're going to get about one more lap out of this one. Caldwell definitely going to get one more. Fong going to get one more. Jeff should definitely get one more as well. Lee by the stripe with 23 to go. So Lee with a possibility here of getting one more lap out of this one. Possibly going to go 13 laps. We'll have to see, though. It's going to come down to his final lap here as he heads through the center diagonal. Big right-hander into the back option section. Takes the inside line. Stuffs it after the double jump, though, so he's not going to make it by anymore for that 13th lap because that 
is time, but Lee Caldwell is going to grab a victory. Might count it as a hollow victory there with McComb breaking out, but it's a victory nonetheless. Fong done in the number two. Smith done in the number three. And